All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. All of my gym stars, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, AKA, woo, fresh from the barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video. Listen, man, got a lot to talk about, a little bit of time to talk about it in. Um, yesterday, we we had a little we had, we had a few things to talk about, man. With the whole with the whole beef that will be extrapolated upon uh, as this goes. But first things first. Look here, man. They're saying that there's a new badge glitch out, and um, that badge glitch is supposed to be very similar to the uh, to the badge glitch that came out, you know, at the beginning of NBA 2K uh, at the, in, 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 in the beginning of NBA 2K20. Um, like I said, you already see who you already see whose channel this is on, man. All that good stuff. Let me show you here. Boom. Now you see the channel. If you want to go check it out, you can go check it out. I'm always skeptical, and on this one, I don't know if this is one. This is one that is, they say you gotta you gotta play the game and pull your joint out, and and I mean and, and put it back in and all that good stuff. Look, man, I don't know if it's real or not. It might work. A lot of people down in the comments are saying it's not working. It's um, and some people are saying it is working. Some people are saying that that, it, that you got to time it absolutely right. All that good stuff. Look here. More or less, what you're doing is you're supposed to be cloning the game and playing the game over. And um, you know, you're supposed to pull your Ethernet cord out. All that good stuff. I don't. I, 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 hey, look, my guy. I don't know if I trust it. I'm gonna show you why. Why I don't know if I trust it. And and, and we just gonna leave it at that. Look here. Look at look look at the, look at the end of this right. Um, he's getting regular VC, regular all this stuff. He's gonna pull this Ethernet cable out, but right here you see teammate grade 135, stats 83, and salary 750, right? All right, you see anything to say a Hall of Fame? Cool. Now he shows where he repeats the process and he says you can do it over and over, reload your player, and you can stack. So he reloaded the same game and all that good stuff, but. Look, I mean, look at look look at the amount of stuff, right? When he gets ready to pull this, look at that. Okay, so he got a badge. I, 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 Hall of Fame. So whoever this was was playing on Hall of Fame. That's number one. The teammate grade was 120. They got a different amount for the uh, teammate grade, different amount of stats. Now I ain't the smartest man in the world, Jenna, but I know you can't change those things. So. How does your team, if, if anything else change, your teammate grade wouldn't change. It's gonna be the same thing, but you damn sure ain't gonna be playing on Hall of Fame difficulty here when in this example, you were playing on, I mean, you weren't playing on Hall of Fame. So all I'm saying is, if you elect to try this out, it might work for you. But if it doesn't, just know that, hey, back your player up, do all this stuff, man. Because I, I just don't understand how you can have a different teammate grade and all of that good stuff. But apparently it works. It's supposed to be one of the best ones out there. All that good stuff. So if you want to try it out, you try it out. I'm not going to try it out. I'm just telling you beware of it and make sure you back your player up and do all of that good stuff because I'm I, I'm I'm deathly afraid of this stuff. I don't want you guys to lose your characters and think something like that works when it's clearly a doc. That's clearly a doctored video. I don't even think anybody could even say anything about it. That's a doctored video. And I just showed you proof that it was a doctored video. That's why he sped it up in the end. Like, we weren't going to notice that part. But, hey, it is what it is. Go by there. Give it a try. Hey, whatever, man. Do it at your own risk, your own discretion, and all that stuff, man. I wouldn't do it. And I'm just trying to show you a reason that you wouldn't want to do it. But, hey, people going to be hard-headed. Some people got to learn. Hard-head, make a soft head. That's what my grandmama always say. Anyway, let's get right down to business, though, man. Which one y'all going with? Somebody asked me to do this in the chat. Oh, we trying to we trying to mix the videos up. So look, a Rolls Royce Phantom or the Mercedes Maybach. I say the Rolls Royce Phantom or the Mercedes Maybach. Let me know which one y'all going with, man. Look, man, I live in Atlanta. We see stuff like this all the time. I'm at a extra regular movie theater and uh, on the other day, and I saw this exact Rolls Royce Phantom parked just casually in the dang on out there just parked out there 
That's that's how it is in Atlanta, man. Everybody got money. And ain't nobody broke around here, man, except for me. But anyway, oh yeah, somebody said, hey Zay, put your PayPal information down there. Just so we can so we can hook you up if we want to. Brother, that's always down there. Go down there, check it out, and uh, all this stuff. Anyway, up next we got Chalk DF. Um, oh yeah, he's gonna be in here for a couple of reasons too. Chalk DF says NBA 2K21 will have new parks, new affiliations. I mean, I mean new parks. I mean, we'll have affiliates. 2K21 will have affiliations, new parks, more advanced dribbling. And uh, the reason that you didn't see the majority, I don't know why people always just say majority, like the majority. The reason that you didn't see the, majo see the majority of this, of that this year is they have to incentive, I mean, they have to be, there has to be an incentive to get the next gen next year. Watch, it will be the best game in the company's history. And he could be right, but our experience with getting next gen 2Ks, I think, uh, what it was, 2K14 was the first next gen 2K, it was really bare bones. So I don't know if it, it was it was clearly it was clearly optimized for the Xbox 360 and then you know they just ported it over to the Xbox 1 and to the PS4. So I, if I'm not mistaken. And then 2K15 was the was the better you know was a good version of it. But 14 I think was the one that they just ported over uh, that you could get. Y'all let me know down yeah it had to be because all the the stuff came out in 2013. So it that would have been 2K14 that they just ported over. I like I said I don't know um I was watching Bass Plug's video and Bass Plug said, hey, yo, Chalk is one of the, he, he pointed out something very, very important. Chalk is the only person ever to have a VC deal with 2K. And that VC deal was so good, I bought that joint twice. But it's, it was supposed to sell out by December 31st. That joint gone. And uh, and it could, I don't know if it had anything to do with, with the fact that you have um, that 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 you were getting a hundred thousand VC instead of the forty five thousand, and you were getting twice the boost and all that stuff. I don't know if it had anything to do with that. All I know is I got mine. You should have gotten yours at that point in time. Uh, look, I, I'm not. I'm, I'm I'm team no VC spent. But when they're giving out a hundred thousand VC for ten dollars and all those boosts and all that stuff that's gonna save me time, I'm going in. But anyway, Chalk is the only person to have a VC deal, just like like Bass Plus said. Not Chris Smooth. Not uh, not none of the other legends. Not Nate. Not none of not, nobody. Nobody ever cashed, none of them guys, annoying, nobody that's up there, Christopher London, uh, So Luminati, nobody ever had a VC deal. So he's probably closer to the 2K situation than any of us are. I don't know if they're going to be using him to leak out the information um, incrementally, but you probably need to be following Chalk, man, if you ain't following Chalk. And if you ain't following Chalk, uh, first off, let's begin with this. I'm gonna show you why you should be following him too, cause boy, this has been a cornucopia of goodness over the last couple of days. My boy EJ, your boy, my boy EJ, your boy EJ says, what if I told y'all the whole TW situation is a big publicity stunt just to get y'all attention so that, I mean, um, so that way they can announce something real big. Remember, just last month they were talking about partnering with a big company. So y'all really think they're about to break up now. Hey, look, man, it don't always work like that, man. You don't never know what's gonna make somebody break up. I am going to believe, I'm one of those people that I don't care enough to believe if you're telling me the truth or not until it's over with. And then I'd be like, you know, I form my opinion from that. Right now, gun to my head, if I had to, to, to tell my opinion on it, I don't think it's fake. I mean, it could be. They should turn it around and, and spin it and say it's fake and do all of that stuff because they do have all the, the community's attention on them and they do have all of that right now. I would spin it, say it's fake, and then, um, you know, try to capitalize off of it. That's just what I would do because, but but I don't think it's fake um, at this moment in time because look, man, you got you got uh, T, uh, T Jack, he's putting out the video. He looks visibly upset. Like this dude don't look like, like look, look, his face is red. He look kind of flustered. He's not looking directly into the camera. He's looking off to the side like people doing you mad. Now, your boy Cole the man, look at Cole the man. He's talking about stuff and he's talking about, look, he ain't looking at the camera either. And he's doing this right here and the whole running your mouth thing. I never really saw people, um, oh my bad. I don't have y'all on the video, do I? Hold on one second. Boom. Look, he doing the whole thing like, hey, why you running your mouth and doing this right here? You know what I'm saying? Like people, these are visual cues that you can pick up on. Unless these are the best actors in the world, it's probably real. Now they might be the best actors in the world. They might have had an acting coach to come in and talk to them about it and all of that stuff and how to do this and that. 
But bro, when people start doing this right here, running your mouth, and 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 that, you see these hand gestures and stuff, and how he's not looking at the camera, to me, it looks like it's real. But anyway, so we're gonna segue into this. Chalk says, "Who wants to fake some beef with me so we can run up our view counts?" That's what he said. I guess innocent enough. Grinding DF came in and says, "You suck." I hate you, please leave DF. You know, Simply Squad, hey, it is what it is. And then, uh, <laughs> Chuck says, yeah, I always wanted to join TNB anyway. Um, you know, freak you, you're stupid, and your stupid mascot. Boom, there we go. Now, Cole, hold on, hold on, hold on. Cole the man comes back and says, uh, let me see, yeah. Since all the rest of the beat, uh, blah, 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 blah. No, 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 no. This is what we go. This was his response to that. Cold the man says, uh, aka Bold the man says, dudes be talking crazy when they just started this YouTube ish. Hit legend and think that you're something special. Ego through the roof. Humble yourself. Oh, hey, they got the Wee Bay up there. I say they got the Wee Bay up there. Hey, the grand OT Grandmaster says, say, say, let them know how you feel, player. Hey, I ain't got all my slides together, man, so you know it is what it is. And then, so Chop came back and said, hey, since all the rest of your beef has been fake, I'm going to assume this uh, this is too, but let me know if it's not. I can definitely share a piece of my mind. Woo! <laughs> Boy, it get, it's a smoke in the city. I shared some smoke in the shit, hey, yeah. All right, so, boom. All right, back to Cole the man. So Cole responded, um, Cole responded, hey, okay, maybe that wasn't that one. But anyway, he says, stop trying to throw shots at me next time, don't talk about, I mean, don't, stop trying to throw shots at me next time, don't talk about views either. Uh, don't let this temporary clout Get to your head. The legend-ish will eventually die out. <laughs> so Cole, so look, he said who wants to start some fake beef. Then he said this. And then Cole said, you know, dude's always trying to say something. And then that's when Chalk said what he said since all the uh since all the other beef. It don't matter what order it was in. All I'm saying is, hey, if this is fake beef, Cole playing it to the bone. And he playing, he taking it all the way to heart, man. I don't know if it's fake. I don't know if it's fake. I mean, look at t -Jack's Twitter. t -Jack saying, look, these past 24 hours have really showed me who's fake and who's real. And he say, I appreciate everybody DMing me and supporting me. I'm not going to respond to any uh, anyone, but I appreciate all the, I appreciate all of you actually supporting me. Like, all this is just like support. Look, look, I'm planning to upload videos. They plan, they uploaded the videos. Like I said, they seem like heartfelt videos. A hey, Breeze TW says, as the founder and the leader of this team and this family, I feel like I failed everyone. I failed my teammates and the fans. We were supposed to be pioneers in the community. We were supposed to show that when when you bring a team like us together, anything's possible. And then here's his statement. We ain't gonna read the whole statement. Last year in the house, blah, 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 blah. But y'all can read that if you want to. And it's at the founder of the team, pretty much heartbroken. I honestly can't believe that things got this bad. And I'm, um, you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. Now, yesterday we did report on it. We were talking about the fact that T-Jack was saying that, um, that people were saying that T-Jack, uh, I was saying that maybe his girl had something to do with it. And he actually said in his video that that was an underlying issue. I told you that that's always an underlying issue. Dudes be getting mad when dudes bring girls into the house, especially if she's there when you ain't there, if she's there all the time and all that stuff. The situation where his bedroom was situated and all of that stuff. Hey, first off, first off, TJ, you need to get you some of this Gym Star apparel. I see you got that Gym Star on. I see you be hitting the gym. I see you got these. I see you out here. You almost got, the, you know what I'm talking about? Hey, 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 you almost bumped like your boy. You almost like this. You almost ripped, TJ. But you need some of that Gym Star apparel, not that Gym Shark. But anyway, uh, like I said, uh, if you order this stuff, we a lot of people's stuff got shipped yesterday. The rest of it's going today. Uh, hey, shout out to my boy JP Time, man. Y'all need to go check out his Twitter and all that stuff. I mean, Instagram and all that. Listen to his music and all that. I'll leave that down below. But anyway, like I said, look, man. This, this type of um, this type of thing ain't no good look. I hope these guys figure it out, get it together. 
get back together, um, talk through it, figure it out, and get back to what's important, which is the money. Because like I said, you have a very short, just like you told Chuck, you got a very short window in order to maximize profits, especially with this game of 2K. You can be good news, you can be big news this year, and you old news next year. I mean, big news last year, old news next year. Y'all love to talk about how people fell off. This community loves to talk about how somebody fell off. I just feel like y'all should, even if y'all are having problems, I think y'all should just get in the room, talk it out, spin it as a publicity stunt, get the new house that y'all was talking about, and boom. If it's not already a publicity stunt, I can't really say that for sure. Uh, I don't look that deep into it. I'm just reporting on it, but I, I, I'm not gonna go behind the scenes and all that. Like I said, I just feel like y'all don't expose nothing on nobody because that's the type of stuff that you can't really come back from. Get in a room, speak your mind, talk to each other, bang it out, uh, bang out an idea, hammer out an idea, Figure out what your next move is. All the eyes in the community are on you. Look, I mean, these videos getting stupid. You're getting, you're getting way more views than you were. Cole the man got 100,000 views on this video already. Obviously, they already get way more views than me. But look, Cole the man, Cole the man normally gets, uh, what he around, you know, uh, yeah, he get over 100,000 views, you know, in a video anyway, right? But he's at 100,000 in a day on this one, and it ain't even been a whole day, 115,020 hours. T-Jack, T-Jack, no, I'm you, T-Jack got 143,000 subs. Um, what'd he get? Look, the last couple of videos, I mean, they stream a lot too. So his last video got 4.8, he's at 39,000 already. Obviously his videos get views, you know, way more views than mine, but the whole point is, the whole community is looking right now, anything y'all put out is gonna be good. You already popping, the whole the whole thing is popping. Hell, y'all should probably partner with Chop and get something popping, man. Hell, maybe that's the end game, the end plan or whatever, they just got, they're just pulling the wool over the whole 2K community's eyes. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know, I don't claim to know. I just feel like I'm a, I'm a solution-oriented person. I feel like people need to work things out, especially when the sums of money involved are, are as stupid as they are right now. That's all it is, man. You gotta figure it out. It's cheaper to keep I say it's cheaper to keep Anyway, hopefully those guys can work that out, but all I need y'all to let me know down in the bottom, Rolls Royce Phantom or Maybach. I say the Rolls Royce Phantom or the Maybach. Y'all let me know which one y'all like down in the uh, down in the comments, the best man. And uh, do y'all think the beef is real? Is it fake or do y'all even care? Or do you even care? I don't know if you even care. It, it really doesn't matter because hopefully this time next month, TW will be, you know, they'll be up there. Everybody will resolve the issues and they'll be pushing toward grinding and grinding and grinding again and, uh, you know, really standing for something or whatever. I, like I said, I, I really don't know about, it, about, about it, all of this stuff. All I do know is that we need... You know, we don't need that type of drama in the community, man. I'm solution-oriented. Just fix it. Fix it, Felix. Fix it. Anyway, I'm about to get up out of here, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me leave a like on the video. If you like the video, like the video. Subscribe for more daily 2K content. And I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Temp. God speak. Oh, yeah. Hey, if you like T-shirts and all this stuff, man, make sure you hit up my merch link. Breeze Tees down in the comments. Uh, all the shirts, Legends Born in December. Uh, custom Christmas bag, you order it by Friday. Hey, you can put sh little Shay Shay on it, all that good stuff. 10% off discount, all that. And I'm out. Peace.